Hello and welcome back to the channel. In this video we're going to set up our 2 terabyte hard drive with the uh, free McBoot pre-installed in it so we don't have to use the free McBoot memory card. Uh, you're going to need a fat PS2, one that you're able to put a network adapter in, as well as one of the two network adapters that I have here. I have uh, basically a game game start with a SATA port on it, and then I have the original Sony one that's IDE, but I transferred it over to SATA. You can watch my previous video to see how I did that. And you're going to need a way to connect the hard drive to a computer, whether it be a USB plug or you plug it directly into the computer. Uh, I do have a piece of cardboard for this here. What I usually do is uh, I put the cardboard underneath it and then I put it in the PS2. It just prevents it from jiggling around, banging or anything like that. But yeah, let's jump over to the computer. We're going to plug this in and we'll get it formatted with free McBoot on it. Okay guys, so now that we're over to the computer, we will need... Uh, two files. We'll need the hard drive raw copy tool as well as our image file. I will leave a link in the description for this website. You can go ahead and download both. But once you do have them downloaded, you will get a uh, 7-zip file. You can just go ahead and extract it and our image is right there. So we can go ahead and r open up hard drive raw tool. We'll just run it as administrator and just say yes. We're going to go down here for file because that's the uh, the file we want. Mine's already displayed there, but you just need to double click there and it'll come up and then find the location to where you have your image file. Go ahead and select it. We'll hit continue. And then from here, we want to make sure that we select the right drive. I know mine's a two terabyte and I know it's a Western Digital. Uh, I do know the model's WD20EZAZ. So I know for a fact that this is the hard drive that I'm going to be using. So we can go ahead and select that and hit continue. Now it just gives us a little bit of warnings here. Um, we just want to confirm that we're taking the image and we're putting it on the right hard drive. Go ahead and hit start. It'll come up with the warning. Are you sure? Because we're not going to be able to get any data back. It's going to be all overwritten. So we'll go ahead and choose yes. And we'll give it a few moments here to finish. It shouldn't take too long. I'll skip ahead for that. Okay guys, so we're just about done there. We'll wait for it to be 100% and our task completed message to come up. And there we go. Once we do see task complete, we can go ahead and close out of the program. And if you have your hard drive plugged directly into your PC, then you go ahead and shut down and remove it. If not, if you have it through the USB, you should be able to come down here and right click and safely remove hardware. But yeah, let's go ahead and get this unplugged and we'll get it plugged into the PS2. Okay, so now that we have our hard drive complete, we can go ahead and plug in our network adapter. I will be using the original Sony network adapter with the upgraded SATA adapter. So we'll go ahead and just plug that in. Like so. And then we can turn around the PS2 and on the back I already have the cap off. But uh, yeah, we'll go ahead and place our cardboard. Now the cardboard's just to make everything snug. It is a snug fit, so it can be a little tight, but uh, yeah, you should be able to slide it in with not too much effort. And then once it's done, just confirm that it is. I'm gonna go ahead and tighten up these screws. And just for the record, we will not be using the free McBoot memory card. So let's go ahead and get this plugged in and we'll get it turned on. Okay, so we'll go ahead and power that on. Give it a few moments. The Sony logo will come up and then the free McBoot will come. It does take a little longer to boot up. I think it's around 30 seconds or so. It's not as, as fast as the memory card. But we'll give it a few moments. There we go. Free McBoot. And here we go now. I will go down the list here so you can see what is here. And that is it. So I'm going to leave the video at that. I will do more videos on the PS2 so make sure you go ahead and hit that subscribe button. And if you did like the video go ahead and hit that like button. It really helps out the channel and I will see you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching.